Good morning everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be continuing from where we left off on the Coruscant assignment by boarding the Flashpoint the Esselus. Before we get underway though, today's video is sponsored by my partnership with W Energy. If you were looking for a clean energy drink that has no sugar, no calories, no maltodextrin, and no artificial colors added, then Dubby is the energy drink for you. It does have about the same amount of caffeine as two cups of coffee, so people who should avoid caffeine, like children, pregnant and nursing women, <clears throat> should avoid drinking it, but it is perfectly safe for everyone else, and it will give you the focus and energy that you need to make it through the day. The discount code JOSHUA265 <clears throat> will get you 10% off of your order, so please feel free to go ahead and go check out Dubby and use that. They do have a starter pack for those who want to try a sample of the product. I will also include the discount link in the comments of the video. Without further ado, let's get underway. Manub Marakanaja, Kinamabam, Yak Manala, Bumogala Apayang, Nilama Imi Amka Anga, Nayana Rankam, Kala Ama Mani Mami, Libig Bak. That's good news. Mim Ilik Maraka, Nayanaram, Kam Kalu Amik Manik, Manala Yang Perlu. Amka Kalami Naya Kira Nubua. Excuse me. Yes, could I speak with you for a moment? You're a soldier. Republic Army, right? I'm sorry to bother you, but I was wondering if you've been contacted by any of the ship's officers. I've not been contacted by any of the ship's personnel. Is there a situation? I heard a rumor that there's an Imperial warship following us. I know, I know. The Treaty of Coruscant. But I don't trust the Empire to keep the peace. The Imps will always be a threat. No treaty's gonna change that. It's good to hear I'm not the only one concerned about the Imperials. The crew won't tell the passengers anything at all. It's not very reassuring. Telling the passengers that Imperials are nearby would only cause a panic. I suppose. Still, I think it's unsettling to think that there might be Imperials behind us. Warning! Warning! Incoming fire! All hands, brace for incoming! Repeat, all hands! causing a panic. Can you hear me? Are you all right? Everything is fully operational. Good, good. That was quite a hit. We're lucky not to be hurt. Listen, you have to get to the bridge. The captain will need all of the help he can get right now. Go, hurry. Let's just hope it's not too late to help. It's never too late to try. Good luck.
Tyrus, you can make it, sir! You can make it! He's gone, sir. You're in charge now. What are our orders? Your orders? Weapons are out! Shields are out! Comms are out! There's nothing we can do! You need to stay calm. Who asked you? We're in the middle of a situation here. The bridge is off limits. Sir, we need all the help we can get. If we don't keep it together here, we're finished. Keep what together? The Imperials have us by the throat! We're as good as dead already! What's wrong with you? Are you really gonna let your ship fall to the Imperials so easily? That ship behind us is one of the biggest in the Imperial fleet! We didn't stand a chance! Sir, incoming message. The Imperial ship is hailing us. What? Oh. Well then put them on. Republic Transport Esselus, this is Grand Moff Rikus Kilrin. Your defenses are entirely disabled. Attempt no resistance. I'm sure we can settle this peaceably. Come now. I think it's obvious I'm not here for friendly diplomacy. Your ship is transporting a known anti-imperial terrorist and seditionist, the so-called Ambassador Vin Asara. I've come to collect her. Who? We didn't take any passengers by that name. I've never even heard of this person. Interesting. Lying or incompetent? No matter. My agents aboard your ship have confirmed the Ambassador is there. Obviously, your agents are misinformed. The First Officer just told you that there's no Ambassador aboard. You'll forgive me if I don't take his word for it, my friend. Imperial soldiers are preparing to board your ship through its primary airlock. My agents will ensure that you do not interfere with them. If you attempt to stop my men from arresting Ambassador Asara, I will have every living thing aboard the Esselus killed. Where is the primary airlock? I'll stop the Imperials as they try to board. Weren't you listening? If we try to fight, they'll slaughter us! We have to cooperate! It won't matter. Kilrin has us now. He'll kill us all. He's famous for it. The only one he wants alive is the Ambassador. If Kilrin gets the Ambassador while we're sitting in his sights, we're goners. Those soldiers have to be stopped before they can succeed. I can hold the line against a pack of imps any day. It's very brave of you to volunteer. Listen, I'm sorry I lost it earlier. It means a lot to have your help right now. Thank you. As a soldier of the Republic, it's my duty to help. Maybe so, but we appreciate your help all the same. I'll have our security team meet you by the primary airlock. They haven't seen much action, but Commander Narlock knows his stuff. Good luck. We're all counting on you. Dead men, this is what you've been training for. The Imperials are coming, and we're not gonna let them pass, are we? Sir, no, sir! And we aren't fighting alone. An experienced volunteer is going to help us. The imps won't stand a chance. Havoc Squad, reporting for duty. Havoc Squad, the best in the Republic. And they're fighting on your side, men. We can't fail. We won't! The imps will cut through any second now. We need to take up defensive positions. Victory or nothing! Surrender! The bridge! You have to hurry! It was all a trap! Victory or the nothing! The Imperials set us up! Turn up! 
The ambassador, capture her at all costs. Man, we've done it! The ship is saved! I'm sorry, Commander, but that... That isn't the case. We defeated the entire boarding party. Nobody could have slipped past us. No, you're right. It's not you the Imperial slipped past. First Officer Hawken walked us right into a trap. The attack on this airlock was a ruse. After Hawken sent you here, Imperial Commandos snuck aboard. They were led by a Mandalorian mercenary called Iron Fist. We defeated the first group of boarders. There's no reason we can't defeat this group, too. It gets worse, I'm afraid. Iron Fist and his Imperial Commando stormed the bridge, and now the entire area is locked down tight. We have to stop the Imperials from gaining control of the ship. That's why I rushed to find you. Something has to be done. Look, what is this all about? Why are the Imperials so desperate to capture you? Because of my work. I'm a Republic ambassador. I traveled to Imperial-controlled planets and convinced their governments to come over to our side. You should have identified yourself earlier, ma'am. I could have better ensured your safety. I appreciate your concern, but this is no time to play bodyguard. We have bigger problems. We need to retake the bridge. The longer we leave the Imperials in control, the harder it'll be to remove them. I already told you, Iron Fist has the bridge locked down. There's no way in or out. A security lockdown. That is bad. Chief Engineer Salen might know of a workaround. Hopefully we can get to Salen before the Imperials. Do you know where he is? He and his team will be down in the engineering section. I'm sure they'll be able to help us. We'll need a diversion. If the Imperials notice the hatches to engineering opening, they'll flood the area with soldiers. My men and I can handle that. Form up, men! We're gonna go start some trouble. Let's get that bridge open. We'll give those imps something to think about, won't we, boys? I'll go along with Commander Narlock. Once you've cleared a path to engineering, I'll double back and join up with you there. Good luck. Soldier? Chief, look, sir, reinforcements are here. You must be crazy coming all the way down here with the imps everywhere. Commander Narlock said that you might know of a way to unlock the bridge. The Imperials have sealed it off. The imps pulled the lock down? You gotta be kidding me. You really cleared this place out. I didn't run into a single Imperial on my way down here. Listen, there's no time to waste. Commander Narlock and his men are being overrun. We have to get the bridge unlocked now. 
So I've heard. I'd invite you in, but the lockdown has our door sealed, too. Are you gonna be safe in there? Do you need help getting out? Getting the bridge back in our control is much more important. Now let's see. What about a reactor reset? That would disengage the security locks, wouldn't it, sir? Yeah, but a reactor reset vents the engineering compartment. We'd be blown into space. Besides, controls are on the other side of the door. What else could we do to open the bridge? The secondary conduits. They're spread around a bit, but if you shut them all down, the security will go down too. Then we'll be in business. I'll get the conduits shut down right away. There's no time to go running all over the ship. If we don't act now, the Imperials will overwhelm us. I'm sorry, Salen. We need to unlock the bridge while we have the chance. We have to reset the reactor. You and your men will be remembered. We can't send these people to their deaths. Not when there's an alternative. What an ambassador she is. Fine. But you're dooming everyone on this ship. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good. We're trying to save the people on this ship, not kill them. Fine. Who am I to argue? You nope. crazy Just witch! Shut Shutting down Please. the secondary conduits will work, I promise! If you're going to do it, go now. The longer you wait, the more Imperials you'll have after you. Something other than just stand around. I love how people who don't play an active role in things think they get a say. How you managed it, but you did. The security doors around the bridge have opened. I'm good. What can I say? I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't been aboard. Probably locked in an Imperial prison, or worse. I'll go and help Narlock with another diversion, so you have as little resistance as possible when you attack the bridge. You'll still have to deal with Iron Fist, though. And that's no small challenge. What do you know about Iron Fist? I only know Iron Fist by reputation. But he's been doing Grand Moff Kilrin's dirty work for a long time now. He's never been captured, defeated, or even driven back. You have your work cut out for you. They didn't just train me to do the easy jobs, ma'am. Just be careful. Mandalorians always have a few tricks up their sleeves. All right. No more time to waste. Narlock, are you there? Can you hear me? Copy! This is Narlock. Set for second offensive? That's right, Commander. I'm on my way to join you now. All right, let's move. Good luck.
I have to step away for just one minute, so hold on for one second. Sorry about that, let's get back underway. That's condescension. Well, well. I was wondering when you'd finally show up. This is it? There aren't more of you? Just give up, Iron Fist. I don't want to have to hurt you or your men. Strange view of the situation. Guess you'd have to be a little crazy to put up the fight you have. Let's vape this worthless scum and get back to work. Good luck with that. Not so easy to get rid of. Go ahead, then. Kill me.
Looks like I'm going to have to sell some stuff here soon. Meant to do it before we started today and I forgot about it. Oops. First Officer Hawken, do you have any spare shuttles in the hangar bay? Spare shuttles? Yes, we do, but I don't... Then that's our only chance. You have to board Grand Moff Kilrin's ship and disable the tractor beam so that we can all escape. Head-on assault, surgical strike, and rapid exfiltration. No problem. I knew we could count on you. I've been aboard warships like Kilrin's. The tractor beam control should be easy to find if you know where you're going. Ambassador, you're familiar with the layout. Perhaps you should go along to help get the tractor beam shut down. Hmm. We need every advantage we can get. It'll be good to have you along, Ambassador. I'll do my best to help in any way I can. Ambassador, before you go, take a spare uniform. We wouldn't want any Imperials to recognize you. Good thinking, Commander. Thank you. Now let's get moving. Good luck out there. We're all counting on you. You just want to get rid of the ambassador by sending her with me. I can't say I blame you, really. Hey, hold up a minute. I need to talk to you before you go. I just talked to Salem from Engineering. He told me what Asara tried to make you do down there. Thank you for stopping her. I can't believe that woman is an ambassador. She's as cold as they come. I'm glad I'm not the only one who's noticed. Listen, I've been thinking. I really believe this plan is going to work. But there's only one way to guarantee that we'll all make it home safe. And that's to make sure the Imperials have no reason to keep chasing us. You want me to hand the ambassador over to the Imperials, don't you? Yes. For the sake of us all, I want you to leave Asara behind, on the Grand Moff ship. With the tractor beam down, we'll be able to escape, but Kilvin will just chase us down again, unless he's already captured his target. As long as Asara is on this ship, everyone aboard is in danger. I don't know about you, but I'm tired of risking all of our lives for that woman. I didn't sacrifice the engineers to get us out of this. I won't sacrifice Asara either. Just think about it. I'd even make it worth your while if things go the way I'm suggesting. Anyway, you'd better get going. I've held you up too long already. Good luck. She may be a pain in the ass, but I'm not going to sacrifice anybody. Not when it's avoidable.
it's always good to get codex entries when you can. Uh, it's a bit of a thing to tell you the story if you take the time to read it. some incredible things in my time, but you just top the list. I'm sorry I couldn't greet you in person. If only you had let me know you were stopping by. Your taunts are useless. This won't stop until the SLS is free. Are you certain, me? I can only be cordial for so much. My men will be along shortly to escort you to the accommodation as I have arranged. Your men can't stop us, Kilren. You greatly overestimate your chances. Iron Fist wasn't the only weapon in my arsenal, nor the deadliest. See you soon. Too.
set to defeat the IS-994, but... <laughs> bonus mission for the SLS. And better gloves. Definitely gotta make sure that at the end of this mission I sell off all this stuff that I don't need.
Alright, here's where things get a bit annoying. Unnecessary. Greetings, a soldier. What a waste. No soldier can match the power of a Sith. You must not have heard of Habat Squad. I don't waste my time with trivial nonsense. To destroy a dangerous foe, that is the way of a true Sith. But you... You are nothing. Less than nothing. I'll do my best to spare you the embarrassment. Such witticisms will not save you. The power of the dark side is infinite. Are you ready to face oblivion? I'm ready to take you out and get on with my mission. Then let's begin! Come on, get onto the shuttles. We have to hurry. If we launch fast enough, I think we can make it. Are you ready? Right behind you, you bastard. Let's just hope Hawkin has the hyperdrive ready. Come on.
And because we decided not to leave Asara behind, we got the title of Uncompromising. I think I'm gonna just stick with Lieutenant, though. Everyone's aboard, Plex. Get us out of here, now! We're safe! You did it! You did what no one else could have done. You've saved us all. We owe you our lives. Every one of us. So on behalf of the passengers and crew of the Republic Transport SS, thank you. Just doing my duty. There's no reason for modesty. What you accomplished here is truly amazing. I took up a collection from everyone on the ship. Hopefully, these credits will help you save other people in need. The same way you saved us. Thank you very much. You deserve far more. Ambassador Asara, it's... It's a relief to see that you made it back to us safely as well. It's a relief to be back, Hakan. I'm just glad that this is all finally over. We're finally safe. I want to thank you again for everything you've done. Heroes like you are hard to come by, and the Republic needs every one they can get. I just did my job. I mean it. If you hadn't been here, we would all be dead for certain. I should warn you, though. Grand Moff Kildren is never going to forget what we've done. He'll stop at nothing to get his revenge. Sounds like I'd better keep my guard up from now on. That would be wise. There's nothing Kilrin isn't capable of. Anyway, enough of that. I'd say it's about time we all relaxed a bit and enjoyed the rest of our trip. Thanks again, and good luck in the future. that we can resume our journey to Coruscant. Seven with Jorgen. And now that we have landed on Coruscant, that is where we are going to stop for the day. Thank you for joining me for today's video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads. And don't forget to subscribe and like. It really helps out the channel. And if you can, visit us over on twitch.tv slash channel 2 and give us a follow over there. See you all in the next one.